Okay, everybody, suitcases are packed and it's time to go. Let's pile into the car. Woohoo! Vacation time, baby! It's about time we took a good old-fashioned road trip, and hopefully this time it won't get cut short because our house sitter threw a party in our house while we were gone. Yeah, that's the last time we get Holt to house sit for us. Never again! I can't wait to hit the road! I made us a road trip playlist on Spotify! It's full of classic bangers like Dance Monkey, Baby by Justin Bieber, and the entire soundtrack to Frozen and Frozen 2! If you put that playlist on, I will throw you out the car window. I'll be in control of the aux cord, thank you very much. Let's just get going. I may be excited for a getaway, but I want to get this drive over as fast as possible. Oh, Cerise, the whole point of a road trip is the driving part. We're gonna have so much fun together. We can sing camp songs on the road, play car bingo, and don't forget the gas station trips to stock up on snacks. See, all of that would be fun if I didn't have to do it with you guys. That seems like a little too many suitcases for an overnight road trip. Abby, 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 when will you learn? Some of us don't like to wear the same outfit for days in a row. I don't do that. Okay, well some of us like to have multiple outfit changes during the day. I'm an Instagram model, remember? I can't wear the same fit in more than one Instagram story, and you better believe I'll be keeping my followers in the loop with hundreds of Instagram stories today. What's wrong with wearing the same outfit two days in a row? Everything! Do you really need to take a separate car, Heath? We're all going to the same place. Um, duh. First of all, I have to make sure all of my suitcases are safely buckled into their own seats. I have a lot of precious cargo in case you weren't aware. Second, I would rather get run over by a semi-truck three times in a row and then have my flattened corpse eaten alive off the road by a pack of vultures than willingly take a road trip with Jackson. Good God. Am I really that bad? You just asked me what was wrong with wearing the same outfit twice. Yes, you're that bad. Don't listen to him, Jackie. Well, have fun with that, Heath. I'm just glad I don't have to listen to Britney Spears' entire discography in the car today. I love me some Britney, but there's only so many times you can hear the song Toxic in one car ride. Speak for yourself? That song never gets old. You losers have no taste. All right, guys, we should really get on the road now. Heath, we'll check back in with you later, okay? Let's go, everyone. <laughs> there. Jackson, we've been driving for like five minutes. Oh. I'm bored. Can you not do this for the entire trip? I'm already annoyed with you. Why don't we sing one of those camp songs I was talking about to pass the time? Please, no. We're not in elementary school anymore, Frankie. Come on, it'll be fun! I'll start us off. A hundred bottles of milk on the wall, a hundred bottles of milk. Take one down, pass it around. Ninety-nine bottles of milk on the wall. Come on, guys, join in! Ninety-nine bottles, bottles of milk on the wall, ninety-nine bottles, bottles of milk. Take one down, pass it around. Ninety-eight bottles of milk on the wall. Ninety-eight bottles of milk on the wall. Ninety-eight bottles of milk. I can't take this! I know I'll regret even saying this, but maybe I should have driven with Heath. No way, we're not that crazy. This is definitely gonna suck, but at least you're not risking your life in a car with Heath while he takes a million selfies. Good point, I guess. I don't know, this is pretty rough. 95 bottles of milk on the wall, 95 bottles of milk, take one down, pass it around, 94 bottles of milk on the wall. Guys, come on, sink it with us. 94 bottles of milk on the wall, 94 bottles of milk, take one down, pass it around, 93 bottles of milk on the wall. Ugh. Ooh, I love this song. I feel like such a baddie right now. I need to update my followers on how cool I am. My swag levels are so off the charts right now. If you ever need a helper, hey, you know Oopsies! Silly me. Luckily I'm hot. I don't have to be good at driving too. Ooh, a Starbucks five miles down the road? Yes, please! I need a caramel frappuccino right about now. You're the only brain I can endure. 
One bottle of milk on the wall. One bottle of milk. Take it down. Pass it around. Two bottles of milk on the wall. Ooh, we finished the entire song. Great job, guys. Although I'd love more participation from the backseat for our next camp song. No more, please, I can't take it. Is it over yet? Yep. Ugh, finally. Um, I have to go to the bathroom. Already? We've only been driving for like half an hour. Sorry, I had to take my anti-road sickness pills before this and I can only swallow pills if I drink a lot of water. I don't think I can hold her for very long. It's okay, we can stop at a gas station pretty soon. This'll be good, we've gotta get some snacks for the road anyway. Well, I can't argue with snacks. Okay, everyone, anyone who needs to go to the bathroom should go now. I'm not sure when our next stop will be. Hopefully there won't be another stop. Our hotel's only a few hours away. We'll never get there if we keep stopping. Huh, I gotta go potty! Okay guys, I'm gonna run in and grab us some snacks and keep an eye on Jackson. Sometimes he locks himself in the bathroom in public places by accident. Okay, this might be harder to get through than I thought. I think my excitement for a vacation outweighed my hatred for spending time with Jackson and Frankie. I wish Dexter and Claudine could have come with us. At least that way the amount of normal people would outnumber the amount of psychos. Hey, why isn't Dexter here anyway? I know Claudine was home visiting her family for the weekend, but I thought Dexter was around. Oh, he's around. He just didn't want to come, you know, for obvious reasons. No amount of bribery could persuade him to get in a car with Jackson. Wow, Jackson really scares everyone away, huh? I almost feel bad. He has no idea how annoying he is. <laughs> Jackie! Jackie! Calm down, you're okay! That man's not gonna hurt you! What's going on? Jackson accidentally walked in on some random guy in the bathroom, and that man was not happy to be walked in on. He yelled at me! <laughs> Yikes. Well, on the plus side, I got some candy for all of us to have in the car. Here, Jackie, have some lollipops to calm you down. Now let's get back on the road. Uh-oh, I think I might have missed my exit back there. Can someone pull up the GPS and type in the address of our hotel? I've got you. Oh shoot, I'm not getting a signal out here. Yep, nothing. Are we lost? Oh no. No, we're not lost. I just got a little turn around. It's okay though, I'm just gonna turn around up here and... Oh no. What was that? Oh my god. Oh goodness, I think we have a flat tire. Ah! Great. It's okay, it's just a little flat tire. Stay calm everyone. Frankie, we have to get out of the middle of the road before someone hits us. Everybody, get out! Let's push the car to the side of the road. Well, this is just great. What now? We're in the middle of nowhere with a flat tire, no phone signal, and Jackson's here. We're stranded!